Pair is a digital wallet which allows you to receive payments and make payments. It also allows you to hold money on the platform entirely for free in currencies such as the USD dollar and euro. But what makes Pair unique is that you can buy, hold and sell cryptocurrencies within the platform. They have got cryptocurrencies such as Bitcoin, Ethereum, USDT and many more. In this video, I'm going to be showing you how to create and verify an account on Pair. So without wasting much of your time, let's get started. So in order to get started, you just need to come to Pair.com. I will also leave the link in the description below. You can click on that link and proceed to create your account. So when you come on the home page, you just need to come and press on where it says create account. The first step is to enter your email address over here. So I will go ahead and enter the email address. After that, you just need to come and press on e, create account. Then all what you need to do is to go to your email address and copy the verification code. Then you come and paste it in here. So I will come to my email address. So you just need to copy the code. Then you come and paste it in here. After that, you come and press on e, create account. The next step is to create a password. So like there's an auto suggested password, you can go ahead and change it to a password which you'll be able to remember later on. So I will go ahead and create my password. Then I will need to repeat it here again. After that, you just need to come down here and press next. But one thing to note here is that you can see how it says secret code. You have to make sure that you master this secret code or you write it somewhere else because later on you might need it in case if you lost access to your account. In order to recover your account, you need to provide your secret code. So make sure that you keep it somewhere safe. So after that, you just need to come and press on it. Next. The next step is to enter your first and last name. But here, you just have to make sure that you are entering your legal name. Because later on, you are going to need to verify your account. So I will go ahead and enter the name. Then after entering your names, you just need to come and press on it, done. So once you reach this stage, this simply means that your account has been created successfully. You can see over here that the account has a daily withdrawal limit of $999. So you will need to verify your account. But before even verifying your account, you can still be able to use your account to deposit and withdraw money. And not only that, you can also use your account to buy and sell cryptocurrencies. Now allow me to show you how to verify your pay account so that your account will not have got any limits. So in order to verify your pay account, all what you need to do is to come and over over your account number and you are going to see where it says the verification. So you are going to come and press on it, go. So here you just need to come and scroll down and then you have to make sure that you enter your personal information. So you are going to enter your name there and your last name. So I will go ahead and enter my name. Then you also need to enter your last name. After entering your last name, you just need to come and enter your date of birth, then month, and birth year. Then you need to enter your country over here. Then after that, you just need to come and press on it, go next. Then in here, you just have to make sure that your email address is correct. Then after that, you just need to come and enter your mobile phone number over here. So I will go ahead and fill out my mobile phone number. Then after that, you just need to come and press on OK. Then all what you need to do is to confirm your phone number. So what is going to happen is that you are going to be caught. Then what you are going to do is to take the last five digits of the incoming phone call number and come and enter them in here. Then after that, you just need to come and press on it, confirm. Uh, you can see over here that our phone number has been successfully linked, meaning our phone number has been confirmed. The next thing you are going to do is just to come down and come and press on it, next. So after entering your personal details and confirming your phone number, all what you need to do in order to complete the verification is to upload some documents. So uh, we are going to upload the documents to confirm our ID, which can be a passport, ID or driver's license. And we are also going to upload a document to prove our address as a proof of address. Another thing to take note of here is that you can also use your phone to upload the documents. So if you want to use your mobile phone to upload the documents in order to complete the verification, 
you just need to come over here and copy this link or you can scan this code qr code with your mobile phone then you are good to go you'll be able to use your phone to complete the verification so for me i'm going to use the passport so we go ahead and choose the document then after that i need to do the same for the proof of what this i just need to come over here and choose file after choosing your documents you just need to come down here and come and press on it submit for verification so you can see over here that the documents have been submitted successfully and they are being reviewed all what you need to do is to wait for three days for the documents to be checked if everything is okay your account is going to be verified it's probably going to take way much shorter than three days for your documents to be checked and for the review process to be completed so before i can let you go let me show you how to use your pay account so if you want to add money to your pay account you just need to come over here on the plus sign and press on it then in here you need to choose the account you want to add money to so let's say if you want to add money to your us dollar account you go with the first one or your euro account you can also add to your crypto addresses your crypto accounts you can add money to them then over here you need to choose the payment system maybe you want to pay with visa or mastercard or maybe you want to pay with cryptocurrencies you can choose any of these that's how you add money to your pay account and if you want to send money you just need to come over here and press on it then uh, here you just need to come and enter the pay account you want to transfer money to another great thing on pay is that it, you can also send money to non pair users so when you come over here you can see that you can send money to someone who has got a perfect money account or someone who has got an active cash account you can also send money to crypto addresses directly from here then if you want to move money between your accounts within there you just need to come and press on this option so you can see over here that you can move money from your bitcoin wallet to your usd account not only that you can move money across all your accounts and it's instantly like you'll be able to move money without a fee from one account to another account within there and in here you'll be able to see your history like the transactions which you have performed in the past you'll be able to find them over this icon here then if you want to access the settings of your account you just need to come and press on this icon over here or you can come here and press on this one then you'll be able to access the settings of your account so this is how you create and verify an account on pair what i want you to do now is to go and watch the next video where i show you how to add money using mastercard or visa card to your pair account thank you very much for watching all the way to the end i hope this video has helped to you if it was please do give it a thumbs up and if you want more videos like this one in the future don't forget to subscribe to the channel for now bye bye see you in the next video